Developments tonight after Macy's announced it will close its store at Parmatown Mall. It's the latest disappointment for a community that's been working to rebuild the mall. News Channel 5's Michael Baldwin is live in Parma tonight. And Michael, what happens next for the mall and what about the people who shop there? Well, basically, Danita, mall officials want to do what's called a refocus. They want local residents to make this mall their first stop while doing their shopping. And they feel they'll be able to accomplish this even without a store like Macy's. It's known as the place where magic happens. Now the Macy's store at the Parmertown Mall will be closing its doors. The people here wish they could pull out one more bag of tricks to keep it open. I am devastated because now Parmertown's going downhill. We had the Dillard's before, but they took that away from us now. So but now we have Macy's going too. The Macy's store here in Parma employs about 94 people. One of those is Anna Fox. She's been here for 10 years. Now she's unsure of her future. I work with a great bunch of women and men in the store. It's so sad to see it little by little chipping away to nothing. And I, I don't know what they're going to do with all this. Actually, the plan is to make Parmertown less of a regional destination and more of a neighborhood shop, much like what you see at Westgate with stores like Marshalls and Books a Million. Here we think there's a, a retail market here, maybe a mixed use, something. Parma's mayor, Tim DeGeter, took office in January and was told about the Macy's situation on day one. Looking forward, the city of Parma working continually as we have been in the past with the receiver, having dialogue, try to find a quality developer that can come in and, and do substantial investment and redevelop uh, the area over at Parmatown Mall. As a new developer is sought, Palmer residents like Mary Margaret want to send a message to potential investors. I mean, it's a great neighborhood. Parma's a good city, you know, we love it. All right, now the mayor and mall officials plan on meeting next week where they will discuss a range of issues. As far as who will replace Macy's, that story is to be continued. Well, I'm Parma. On your side, I'm Michael Baldwin, News Channel 5.